We bless the Lord, and we would like for uh, the audience to be able to hear this testimony of our, two of our saints in our church, and I tell you, it's a mighty testimony concerning love and hate, concerning relationship, concerning paths, and we want you to know that God is a God that erases the path. Mm -hmm. God's a God that directs the hearts and the mind of men and women. So I want you to hear the testimony of these two saints here at Antioch Apostolic Ministry. Amen. We stand before you as two of God's children, but we share one testimony. In all things, we must glorify God. And pastor, as pastor says, all means all. He has also taught us not to be ashamed of where we come from, for it's because of our past we can always measure how far God's brought us from. In 1998, Sister Trina's brother sexually assaulted and nearly killed my grandmother. Although we didn't know each other, our families were sworn enemies and never dreamed how God would bring us together today. My brother was sentenced to 20 years in a correction facility. And I will never forget my mother's pain as they led him out the courtroom that day. But through it all, whoever thought Sister McBride and myself would stand as urchins at the door, doors of the, house, of the same church, or that we would praise God, shout, and worship together as sisters in Christ. Who knew Sister Trina would pray with me and believe God with me to receive the Holy Ghost, or that I would one day help her achieve her goal of learning to drive? My God. Or that I would hold and love her children. God's grace is sufficient. He brought us from the gutter to his glory. Hallelujah. My God. The Bible says in Psalms 2 and 4, He brought me through the banqueting house, and his banner over, my, over me was love. And in John 13 and 35, By this shall all men know That's that it. ye are my disciples, my if ye have love one to another. Hallelujah. John 15 13 says, Greater love have no man than this, that a man lay down his life for his friends. And in Romans 13 and 10, tells us, Love worketh no ill to his neighbor. Therefore, love is the fulfilling of the law. Yes. We share this testimony, saints, to first glorify God. And second, we pray, if any among you are holding hatred in your heart, or a grudge against someone, that you would allow the love of God to help you to forgive and to truly love. Amen, amen, amen. God bless you. To God be the glory. Amen, amen, amen. amen.